So here we're going to have a brief look at Mention, which is a social media listening program. Um, I signed in to Mention. Uh, the reason I'm mentioning it, no pun intended, is because they have a very robust one month trial where you can use all the features in their listening program. And then after one month, it defaults you back to the free program and you don't have to have a credit card. So if you want to practice listening or you want to do some listening for real, um, Mention is a pretty easy one to use. I set up myself as Florida International University, don't tell anybody, and I chose as my competitors Miami-Dade College, Florida Atlantic University, and the University of Miami. Uh, this is essentially the feed of all the mentions of FIU uh, in almost any media. They cover social, most social medias, Reddit, most blogs that are public, as well as traditional news sources. One of the things I'm noticing is that for some reason the bridge has popped up again. And I'm wondering why that is, because if I am Florida International University, I would really rather people not talk about the bridge. Um, ah, because there is a two-page report today on the bridge. And so we're going to find any number of stories today about the bridge. Not our favorite. I want to look and see how that's affecting us. I can go into reports. This is only on Florida International University. I'm going to edit this one. And this is all the negative sentiment. This is mentions in general, which you'll see peaked on the 14th with somewhat over 300 mentions. And what we have now from the 15th is we see our negatives starting to go up. We're pretty sure we know what those negatives are. Um, we can sort out where well, this is the, the filters that we can add to it. For instance, I can do let's see, a stacked bar chart, right? So here's our negatives. And I'm only looking for negative sentiment. And I can also see that, unfortunately, it seems like my reach is also gone up. Just at the same time, my negatives have gone up, although reach went up a little earlier than the negatives did. And so the basic idea behind listening is that you set up some sort of report that tells you when a problem is happening. So that when you look and you see that there's a spike like this, right, in negative stories, now I want to know why. I go back to my feed and I can find them. And I can search in the, the history, the filters, I can folders. Ah, I can choose negative and apply filters and here's all the negative stories from today and sure enough they are all about, about oh well no there's one about Panthersoft and there's some about the election but most of our traction today is coming from the bridge which makes sense So that's the basis, basic um, way you look at uh, listening. Now, when I go here to my reports, okay, this is the visual representation of what I just saw in the feed. This is my reach, which is the number of opportunities to see, the number of people who can possibly have seen the mention of FIU, and these. this is the number that it has judged as negative. It is a 
plus 3,000% increase in the seven days that I'm looking at, starting from the ninth, because on the ninth there were two <laughs> negative <laughs> stories. But usually you'd have a little bit more data to look at. Now, another one as far as data visualization goes is if I do competitive analysis, I can look at our share of voice. And this includes my competitors. So Florida International University is this one, right? And Miami-Dade College is that. And Florida Atlantic is that. And here's the University of Miami right there. Now, let me edit this. And I'm going to pick a period. Less seven. Actually, you know what? Because I know the problem is today. So let's look today and just see what's happening today. Save report. OK, and this, of course, is Fortunately, not as bad as I thought it would be. Um, this is FIU, and you can see on Twitter, um, and just so you know that usually University of Miami has a lot more Twitter mentions than we do because of football. Um, but you can see that today, FIU is catching up, and that's probably because most of the bad news about us is on Twitter. Um, This is the in general, and you'll see the University of Miami is still driving more than half of the share of voice, but we do have a rather significant increase. And here on Facebook, uh, we have no presence. And you can see here, if we look at where this, where this, um, these mentions are coming from, and we're at the bottom here, you can see that it is Twitter news and blogs suggesting that the news is driving to the Twitter conversation which is also showing up on some blogs. And you can compare our sentiment. This is FIU. Today it is more negative than positive, which is unusual. Um, and we can see it's all positive in Miami-Dade. Um, actually more negative than positive at FAU, and I don't know why, although most of them are neutral. And always, generally, most of the stories are considered to be neutral. Um, and University of Miami has slightly more negatives and positives as well. You can go through and hand code these if you need to, um, to figure out if the neutral ones are really neutral or if they're actually positive. Anyhow, that's a basic look at mention.